Good morning, loves. Well, afternoon. I am about to go walking, as you can see before I flip the camera around. About to head out to the park and take a stroll. Just wanted to show y'all my workout outfit. It's so cute. But this is what I'm wearing to the park. It says Courage Walmart. Walmart, honey. Walmart. Everything came from Walmart, but the shoes, my new balance. But yeah, so you know when you cute, you got when you look cute, you well, you wanna do better, but you could be cute while you work out. Yeah, so we about to go to the park. Probably pull y'all out at the park, let y'all see. What park we at? It's a nice park. I don't know. I need to I probably won't wear my face mask since I'm going to the park. I'll be outside. But yeah, so how's everybody doing on quarantine? This little quarantine that we still in. Hopefully they you know, everybody is working, can pay their bills, do all that stuff. If you work. If you got a place to pay bills at, you know. But so let's head out. I'll catch back up with y'all when I get to the park. Bye. It's chilly. Okay, so I'm in the core. But it's chilly out here. I'm kind of glad I wore a sweater. But, you know, I need to start. I don't mind being fluffy, you know, fluffy and all. But I got to tone down some of this fluffiness. I ain't trying to be no skinny girl. No, no, no. Don't want to be that. Still got to have my little thickness going on. But I'm going to tone down the thickness. So, about to go to this park. I got my waistband on. Yeah. I think I need to get a new one. Because this one, um, I got, I think, I can't remember what size I got. But because I did lose a little bit of weight, it is like... I have to pull it tighter which is a good thing but um, I think I'm gonna get another one they love to um, let their dogs be off the leash like like everybody a dog friend in case you don't know like everybody dog friendly I'm not a dog person not at all if you got a dog that's your business but hey I say they cute from a distance, but I don't like dogs at all. My neighbor got a dog. She, two, two, A lot of my neighbors got dogs, but it's this one girl that lived by me. She seems to think that I want to play with her dog. and I don't want to play with your dog, honey. Keep your dog to yourself. Leash it up. We do have a leash law. Leash it up. Because <laughs> you got a pit bull. That thing big. And, uh, yeah. So, I guess she feel like she shouldn't have to leash her dog up. I should be able to deal with it. But some people just got to understand that everybody is not, you know, dog friendly. Everybody don't like dogs. And you can't make people like your dog. You just have to be respectful of that. I feel like... Just like you want your dog to be comfortable, I want to be comfortable because I'm paying rent. Your dog ain't paying rent. You paying rent for your dog. So, yeah. But I guess they feel like the dog paying, going to work and paying the rent. But mm -mm, I don't. Sorry. I want to be comfortable in my own home. Enough of my little dog rant. I'm going to talk to y'all when I get to the park. If I bring y'all out. Because it's hard to walk and have a camera in your hand. So. Hey loves. How y'all doing today? We headed to Walmart. Okay. I didn't get a chance to show y'all what I had on today. But it's like really warm here. So I put on my little black biker shorts with the red stripe down the side with this cute little top that I got from Route 21. Um, so yeah, so I'm about to go to Walmart and get some stuff for Lexi for her birthday. You know, like some cute little stuff for her. Um, pick up a few things for the house because I noticed we was out of a few things. 
and yes, I do have my mask. It matches my outfit. Not that it matters, but you know, got to coordinate. We gonna be these things is like accessories now. No, I'm just <laughs> accessories that keep you safe. <laughs> but yeah, courtesy of my job. Thank you. They make sure we taken care of on that part. I wish they'd take care of the coins though a little better. During this hat, give me that hazard pay, you know. But I'm about to head over here because I'm being lazy. I need to get. Are they coming across? Oh, I guess they're going the other way. I thought they was about to turn, but I need to go get. I've been being lazy, like I was saying, and my tire on the passenger side in the back, it needs to actually be um, be changed. So, I ain't gonna get a new tire. So, I'm heading down to put some air in it. Yeah. But, ultimately, the goal is on Monday to get a new tire. Because it's really low. But yeah, so I just got word from my one up that my department is opening back up. I'm kind of excited, kind of sad too, because I was liking, I was kind of liking working in the staffing office and you know getting my little three days a week, 12 hour shifts. Then have my little half day once a week, even though them 12s was killing me because I was up all day and all night, but. You know, I liked having a day off through the week. Now it's going back to five days a week. Monday through Friday. But it's all right. I'm just grateful to have a job. Just blessed for that. Because we are actually, I work for a hospital. So they're actually, our governor said that they can do like surgeries, open surgeries back up. So because I work in a surgical department, I gotta go back to work. Yeah. But I did take a position in the staffing office for PRN, just part-time. But let me go put the air in the tire and I'll be right back. Good morning, loves. So I am getting ready for work. Started back to my hour to my seven days a week not seven days a week five days a week eight hours a day i was liking um i don't know i was liking working um just three twelves in a half day that was really nice i got used to that having a day off through the week but to the basics at least i get off at 4 30 every day now so i can't complain about that but yeah so today will be exciting when i get off from work today i am going fairy dusting y'all probably like what the heck is fairy dusting so i'm in this group on facebook and um it's called wine fairies of champagne of where like from where i live and um you pick a few people and you go and you, it's kind of like back in the day when we used to do like ding dong ditch where you ring the doorbell and you run um so basically you just you get some bags together with wine and put like a few little trinkets in it like some nice stuff you could put whatever you want in the bag you could put candy you could put just some nice stuff you know just for somebody just a little some a little nice gesture to give. So I made a few bags. I'm not giving them all out today. I'm just gonna spread them out throughout these a few weeks. But I did go ahead and make some bags up. I'm gonna go out today with my friend. And we're gonna spread a little love and cheer today. I think it's fun. It's just something nice to do while you're in quarantine and you know. Just to show somebody some little cheer. You know, you never know how somebody day been going. They may have had a bad day. This is not a good bun, but... Y'all, I need to find something to do with this head. I need to open the hair supply store up. Is y'all hair supply store open? Because ours not. 
They say you could do drive up orders, but I like to go in. I want to pick up my own stuff and then I don't want to, um, I don't really trust giving nobody my card and letting them go in the store and run my card for me. I don't know how I feel about that. Like, they could be ringing stuff up, overcharging. I'd rather be right there so I can make sure. So, bun it is until to the hair store open up. But yeah. So I was seeing like I seen a few people on YouTube. They they opened up like one girl she was at Burlington's. They opened up in her town. I don't know exactly where she's from, but I saw that. I don't know. I'm not rushing back into the stores like At work, it's really weird because usually I have patients in my office, but right now I'm not. I just call them over the phone and let them know. Um, I don't take payments or anything. The girls that sit out front, they take the payments now. So, you know, I got to protect myself. I don't know what these people got, but no. So, here got my bags that I made. I'm going to show y'all. So here got my little fairy bags and the little ones is shots because I'm in the shots group and the big ones is wine so yeah so it's gonna be fun I'm not handing out all those bags today mm -mm. I spent about I know the people in the store was like I should I'm gonna take y'all with me next time I go get wine and stuff but I know people in the store was like Girl, this girl is an alcoholic. <laughs> Cause I had like eight bottles of wine, three of those little wine cooler pouches, and then I got like fourteen shots. Yeah, it's a lot of stuff. I'm not handing all that out today. So yeah, but if I can, if I remember when I come home and change, I'm gonna grab my camera and take y'all with me. But let me finish getting dressed and I will holler back at y'all later when we go out spreading a little fairy dust. Have a great day. Hey loves, welcome back. And if you're new to my channel, welcome to have to have you. Before you go any further, please hit the subscribe button because honey, you will not be disappointed. And to my old subscribers that have been with me for a while, thank you. It's greatly appreciated. Love y'all. But today I am about to get ready to head out. I'm going to Myers. They're having a really good sale. I think they got a few items that I clicked into my Myers account that I wanted to pick up. And then as always, I'll just go through the store and see what they got. Because ain't nothing open but where I'm at. But Myers, Target, stuff like that. So, you know, just look. Myers be having some cute stuff though sometimes. I'll be finding some cute stuff there. But whew, I'll be so glad when next Saturday get here because this beast this she will be tamed. Okay, okay. She's getting braided, period. <laughs> but anyway, how's everybody been doing? I hope good. Some of y'all probably not in a quarantine no more. We sent, we kind of not, kind of, sort of, we got like a few things lifted where I'm at. Um, I think we move into phase three on the 29th, on May 29th. So, I'm so glad because I'm not going to be like outside, outside, but I want to get my feet done. I'm tired. I'm tired. And I'm deprived of not having my feet done. Oh, it's just a struggle. The struggle is real. And my eyebrows, they don't look too bad, but I ain't giving y'all a close-up. <laughs> no close-ups. But yeah, so 
we just gonna put her like this today in this big old ponytail I combed it out I combed my hair out today so that's why she look extra fluffy but by the time I get back it's gonna be <laughs> I gotta stop going to bed and just putting my bonnet on without I need to braid my hair down before I go to sleep because natural hair yeah it's a lot if you're natural you know what I mean my natural girls y'all know y'all know the struggle it gets tangly quick yeah they do but I like it it's better than putting all those chemicals in my head and all that stuff cuz I'm paying for it now well not really because when I got um relaxers some people call them perms my mom do hair my grandma do hair so the correct term is relaxer because a perm actually makes your hair go curly um so when I was getting relaxers because I used to call them a perm too I'm not gonna lie but after you live around a lot of cosmetologists and they keep correcting you for years and years then you learn the term <laughs> relaxer because if I say perm around my mom she's gonna be like it's not a perm it's a relaxer so relaxer when I got them, I wasn't getting them as often as like, you know, I think some people get them like, um, maybe like, I, I can't remember, is it every six weeks? Like every, every two months, so I can't remember, but I was only getting them twice a year because I really didn't need them, but it helped my mom manage my hair better when I was younger when well, you got four girls you gotta do all their hair you know if it's straighter at work it helps you out be able to get it better and but it didn't matter because my mom used to press our hair when we was little too um that didn't last long on me no and I was always I was always the last because my hair was the longest. If I could find, I'm gonna see if I could find a picture. Let me see if I can find a picture for y'all. Cause I got a picture on my Facebook. I was always the last to get my hair done. Okay, because my hair was the longest and it was the thickest. And she just was like, "I'm not doing it." No, okay. You be last one in the chair. Always. Always, always. So, if you, my grandma is the one. I did a video for her birthday. If y'all want to see what she looks like, she's so pretty. Go check that out. It had a picture of her back in the day. I love back in the day pictures. She's so beautiful. But yeah. So, let's see. Right there is me, the little girl on the end with the bonnet on. Yeah. The one in the red and the other one on the end in the black and white. Those are my two sisters. The one in the red is me and her have the same mom. And just um, the one on the end, me, she has the same dad as us. So, But we're all sisters. So, but, yeah, so my hair was the longest and the thickest. Okay, that's... So, guess who had to be deprived? It had to wait. Me your girl but it's okay so yeah so I I went natural a few years ago when I got grown and I was doing <laughs> my mama wasn't doing my hair no more she still clipped my ends um, every now and then because I don't like to go to the beauty shop because they take too much off y'all know what I mean I'm gonna cut this out the video <laughs> But anyway, I'm about to get ready. I think my husband was somewhere in my car. I gotta find find out. He keep going from the car to the truck, from the car to the truck, car truck, car truck. It's very annoying. I don't drive the truck. Cause I just have short people problems and I don't drive the truck. So now I gotta find my car because he didn't tell me he was running out. So whenever I find the car, we gonna go and we gonna head out. We gonna go to Meyer. I'm going to try and take, I always tell y'all I'm going to take y'all in the store with me and I forget. I I always forget my camera. I just think with like this pandemic and stuff going on, I'll be trying to get 
in and out of the store. Um, girl, I ain't in no Walmart gift card. I be trying to get in and out of the store as fast as possible. So, I don't be taking my camera with me. Because if I take the camera with me, it's going to slow me down. Um, I don't know. I'm going to try it today and see what happens. Because I just... Lately, I just write down what I want, what I need to go in there and get. And then going to the store with my mom is... I'll be at the store all day. I told y'all that, but I'm be at the store all day. <sighs> she don't know how to go in and out. She probably at home waiting on me now. But as soon as I figure out when he coming back with this car, I'm gonna go. Anywho, if I don't come back, I'm gonna see y'all later. I am uploading a video of my crop tops collection. Just thought it was something different. Um probably y'all probably gonna see that before you see this because i'm telling you girl <laughs> i be behind i be trying but yeah and i got a lot more special things for y'all i think i'm gonna do a um because i buy a lot of the time and true jeggings for walmart i just like them i think they're comfortable and you know me comfortably cute i'm always comfortably cute i buy clothes i don't know what i buy them for because I just rather be comfortable but I used to buy the time and true because I wore them to my um, other job it was like more of a business casual setting and I was like oh okay these cute comfortable gotta move around a lot because I was in a dentist office so I was always back and forth from the front to the back from front to the back so I just wanted something that was like comfortable you know and easy to move in so I probably will go through that collection with y'all so y'all can see you know, hey, try them out. It, wear them to work in the workplace. <laughs> they won't know. Shh. But hey, so let's um, let me find my car. Dude, where's my car? 